November 1, 2025, Hi, I'm Mike Thompson, and welcome to 121 Point Mike Ground School. In this video, I'm going to explain the Automated Terminal Information Service, or ATIS. The ATIS frees up the main communications frequency and provides you with the information you need to know so that you can safely get where you need to go or navigate safely while taxiing. It does so much more than just the weather. It'd be absolutely awful if a controller had to read all that information each time that a pilot asked for it, so they broadcast it continuously on a different frequency. Don't try to talk to the ATIS man though, he's deaf. On a chart, the frequency is listed next to the airport, and an ATIS will only be available at the busier airports, so don't expect the airport and podunk to have an ATIS, but they might have an AWOS or ASOS, which only does weather. So, let's monitor our COM2 and listen to an ATIS, and then do some hammer time on it. Number open information, Oscar, 1447 Zulu, wind 0403, visibility 10, scattered 2400, ceiling broken 5000, temperature 2 9 er 2.22, altimeter 3002, expect a visual approach, runway 12 in use, right bar clearance, contact ground on 121.7, caution for bird activity on and in the vicinity of the airport. Notams, taxiway Alpha closed between Alpha 3 and west of taxiway Delta. Taxiway Alpha 3 closed. Expect taxi route through the ramp area. Advise on contactive information, Oscar. The ATIS gave the airport name and an information ID letter, Oscar in this case. Each time there's a reportable change in the weather, they'll use the next letter of the alphabet. Next up was the time of the report in Zulu time. So you'll have to do some math to convert it to your current time zone and maybe double check that math to account for daylight savings time. Then they're going to give you the wind. The wind, it comes in three digit direction and an at for the speed in knots. Next comes the sky condition or how high the clouds are. Now cloud heights are reported in height above the ground, not mean sea level. If there are several cloud layers, they might give you each of their heights and specify the amount of coverage. A ceiling is defined as the lowest broken layer though. Broken is nearly overcast, which of course means total coverage. Then they'll tell you how far you can see. And this figure is reported in statute miles, not nautical ones. Or it might be given as a runway visual range if the visibility is restricted. Of course, if it's an RVR though, you VFR pilots won't be flying. Now, they'll give you the temperature and dew point in degrees Celsius or centigrade. Next comes the altimeter setting. You'll stick this number into your Colesman window. Lastly, all the important safety and info and instructions and other things, all the stuff in addition to the weather will be last. ATIS is so much more than just the weather, and that's all that AWOS and ASOS are good for. You'll use the ATIS before taxi, possibly over an en route airport, and before you reach your destination. If you've been out smashing bugs locally, you'll check the ATIS at your airport before you return in case the weather has changed. It probably has. The ATIS is really simple because it's spoken in clear American and it's not encoded like a TAF or a METAR is. Yeah, I probably should do a video on those at some point. But the ATIS will change any time that there's a new official weather report, regardless if any of the values have changed. The controllers will tell you if this happens by saying something like, Attention all aircraft, information mic, current. Or, Attention all aircraft, information mic, current. If they say that, go check out the ATIS right now. The ATIS will first give you the weather, but then all the other safety information that you need to know to land safely or navigate the airport pavement. Anyway, that's the what, when, why, and how of the ATIS. Now you know what you need to know. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. That'll certainly help me out, as will leaving a comment down below. It'll notify you when the next video comes out so you don't miss a thing. And stay with me on 121 Point Mike.